back guys welcome back to my video so i'm gonna try to record my phone more because your phone has more storage than my ipad and i just you know i'm gonna try something new i probably still will move to like a laptop because i'm pretty bad at roblox in a laptop so i probably will move so anyway i got two halloween guns while grinding because who doesn't want it i got this the orange lx3 look at this cool effect and i got the orange gun gun so that's pretty cool too. Also, if you have the what's it, what is this called? If you have the cultist armor, when you jump, it makes a sound. That's very neat. So I'm in a private server. So unfortunately, in this video I will not be killing anybody. And also, someone asked how to get the badges. Um, buddy, I, I think it's in the description. You literally have to kill the cultists, the pumpkin, the big pumpkin dudes. Alright, so first let's get the orange thing. This has a 50% damage buff. So basically, this thing does 75 damage for a body shot. So basically, it does an LX3 headshot damage. So that's really neat. The headshot is in 100, so from Lots of people call this mid, I don't play them. Because they go If you're the average player, you call this. It'd be pretty awkward, it should be pretty good. But yeah. I mean, it is new. It is new. It's so yeah. I'd say this is a pretty decent weapon. It's not the best weapon to go either. Let me know if you guys want to see more videos on my phone. This is all kind of boring with the commentary and no editing. But if I do continue to make videos on my phone, I will like uh, edit them to make the videos better. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna go to Reaper. This guys. Oh yeah, Cold Armor gives you uh, 66 extra health. That's very nice. This does around 5,600 damage to 6,000. Actually, I'm going to really be going to Reaper now. So we can just test it on him. Yeah, I got this guy that heals at 18 health. And that might not seem like a lot, but this is actually a lot. He heals so much faster. So it's double the heal. Estimate that's around 165 to 170. Can't be too good. I don't know how much damage the damage buff for
I didn't say that this would do the point. I mean, this is still pretty good. Still. I think it's still good. Let's see if I beat it. I'm gonna look for Mechal Lantern. I wanna see if we can find Mechal Lantern. And then I'll end the video if I die from the mech. Because I can't really stay here for long while I go to bed. Alright, so we're just we're gonna wait until the next event. I will kill some more. That's the most ideal place to go. But yeah, recording points is probably better because when I try to record my voice on my um, the, the sounds of the game to like Oh, you can hear it. Yeah, if you kill an enemy with orange out, you just have to get that, that orange thing. Pretty neat. I like this because it can actually one shot cyber now because the original that I can do is 4,000 damage that's such an odd number just make it 5,000 just why is it 4,500 just make it 5,000 I'm glad this comes up with this stuff so it's pretty odd see I'm not really sure how much this that does but it's probably like probably does 25% more damage because I feel like the creator would think 50% is a little too excessive and would like almost like match his black hole generator's damage. So yeah. Alright, we're in the portal so hopefully that comes. I don't want to worry myself killing a Reaper with orange guns in the score and it was less time to gatling. Oh great, it's black hole. That's one of the I'm gonna go fight Zombie Food. If I die, I'll just end the video. Right? Second floor. I wish. I think the second floor should be expanded more. That would be nice. Italy has two very important areas, especially in the incinerator area, which everyone loves because burning sword, but it's still pretty underrated. You just need to imagine a prison built like this, like this very small cafeteria here, all the jail cells are there. You know, a prisoner could literally just walk out, go here, get it, go here, probably get the burning sword, and then they should kill every single security guard in the facility. And yet they didn't think about that. That's absolutely weird. I love how That's the small little video I made, even though it's like almost 10 minutes. It's probably hit the 10 minute mark. So, yeah. I think the weapons aren't too bad, aren't too good. They're like probably in between. I like Orange Gogo though. And I can't wait to get the Crescendo. You know, um, is there a Crescendo and there's a Open Go Crescendo? That's really nice. I mean, so, yeah. I'll be, I'll, I'll be looking forward to get this. 
I've heard some um, rumors that this is faster than Slasher, so that's nice. So yeah, that's it lads. Hope I'll see you guys later.